Hi, welcome to Rhonda Said. I'm Rhonda. I love saying things. And I've got a new shirt. Bum, bum. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm so happy to see you. I don't just have a roll of quarters in my pants. Uh, <laughs> we're doing a get ready with me with the jalapeno palette, little bite palette from e.l.f. today. I love greens. I will continue to love greens for a long time. And I've been waiting to get this palette to come back in stock for forever, it seems like. And I'm just so happy to have it that I could dance around like a little girl. Mm, a little girl. I am a little girl. Okay, I haven't been a little girl in like a minute, but let's start getting ready. I am using the Miracle Cream from Juno. It's a miracle cream, so I put it on my throat as well. What are you guys up to? It's been pretty chill here in the world of Rhonda. And as I say that, the cats start to fight. So if that's my biggest problem, then I'm doing great. That's the way I look at it. And I think that you should look at it like that too. You know, it's all about managing expectations in life, you know. I like to manage mine with a little makeup. But a lot of the problems that I've ever had have been my expectations on other people. You know, expecting them to act the way that I want them to act or expecting something out of someone, you know, sets me up for resentments. I know it's a little heavy for or this early in the day, but I just thought I would throw that in there. I feel deep and philosophical today, and this is my favorite concealer, which is the Pretty Fresh with Hydrolonic Acid from ColourPop. And it's nine bucks, and it's just as good as any other fucking concealer I've tried high-end or otherwise and it's just as good as anything else and nine bucks is affordable and i'm about i'm a little bougie i'm a little classy i'm a little ratchet but i do like to be affordable on occasion and speaking of that we are using the superstay maybelline 24 hour wear foundation today we're trying out the maybelline foundations And this is in color 102. I think it's a little fair, but it matches my neck. I've been out a little bit, but you know, I'm wearing my mask. I'm staying six feet away from people if I can. Things are not getting better. COVID wise. Just grateful I'm not in Florida or Texas where the shit is hitting the fan. In mean, Kentucky it's still it's still growing. In the KY. Not the jelly. One of my favorite jokes here in the KY. And there we have the, oh, looks like I missed over my brow. There we go. I'm gonna set it with the, I always forget what this is called. Hydra Mist powder from Becca. I like it so much. I'm going to set my face with some all nighter from Urban Decay. That way it sets everything down so I don't have just a big weird powdery face, which I like. Here's my very dirty Jeffree Star. Look at that. It's filthy. 
I got it last year on sale. And yes, there are such things as Jeffree Star sales. Um, I'm going to use my Cheek Stars for my bronzer and blush. No, nope. my bronzer. I got a new blush to try. And this is Hula. So anyway, my birthday is coming up. When you see this, I don't know if it'll be before or after my birthday. My birthday is the first. I just don't know sometimes when I'm gonna post these videos because I've got a lot recorded already. And this is a NARS blush palette and it is called The Star Scene. Look how, look at those little stars. And I got it on sale for like 21 bucks on Ulta. And it's got a little highlighter in it and some blushes. I'm gonna go for this middle blush. I've never used a NARS blush. I've got a couple NARS lips. And they are famous for their orgasm blush, which this is not. But I don't think it's that far off color wise. Looks like I need to. Tone down my little, my left side always gets weird. But it's always like that. Let's try the highlighter today too. And I'm using my little Luxie fan brush. It's a real pretty highlighter. Kind of a, let's see if it shows it usually shows up better on the left side there we go it's really pretty a little subtle but very pretty and this is great two blushes and a highlighter for 21 bucks i wouldn't have got it if it wasn't on sale Let's just say that. And I'm going to be using this little tiny elf jalapeno. It covers my mouth. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm just like, aye aye, Captain. I am a dork. And this is super pretty. Let's swatch it. There is swatches, and I feel like I need like a little extra help on this palette. So I'm gonna get something with some neutrals real quick. I've got this Cheers palette from Profusion, and I'm going to get my little fluffy brush. And I'm going to put this color here, Fame, under my brow bone. And just down into the crease. Just to get it set up a little. All right, so it's just a little help. There's plenty of other good stuff in this palette. Don't you panic, babies. So, I'm going to put this color, doesn't have a name, on the crease. It's kind of shimmery and really pretty. For three bucks, you just cannot beat these little palettes for three dollars. There's no hollers for three dollars. And I, this was the first one I wanted to try. I have all the bite size, but it sold out the first. 
And then I had the acai berry one that I tried. And that was good. I'm giving some away in some future giveaways. I think Rum is rocking out in the kitchen. I hope you can't hear it. Because that could cause me trouble. I'm going to put this in the crease also. Do a little halo eye with this little golden color. Probably should have shut the door, but I don't think you can hear it. I can barely hear it. But this is super pretty. I feel like it needs to be built up on this side some more. Super pretty, super pretty. I can't wait to put this little goldy green yellow thing on my lid. It's just the cutest. So pretty. It's kind of iridescent like a little bug belly. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Like those, those iridescent bugs, like little fancy flies or something. And that's a super cute start. I think I want to take the second color up a little higher. Because I'm going to go in with the darker colors in a second. I don't want it to disappear completely. There we go. I just love it. Now we're going to go into this more olive color. It's so tiny. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the stuff. That's what I'm talking about. So pretty. Oh, it looks so good. I'm going to put a little bit of that darker screen. I'm gonna blend it out, work it out. Three dollars, and look how awesome and pigmented it is. I have much more expensive palettes that aren't as cool. And you won't believe this. I know you won't believe this, but I'm gonna try a new eyeliner today instead of my Too Faced. I'm gonna give it a go with the Hyper Easy Eyeliner from Maybelline. This comes in a package like that. It's so written so small on here, it's hard to tell. But when I swatched it, it's nice and black. And it looks like it has a good line. So we're going to use that for the eyeliner today. not as black as my Too Faced, but for like seven or eight dollars it's doing a good job. The brush is a lot different. It's cute though. It's working. 
And for the money, you cannot beat it. Very pretty. All right, let's do some brows with the fluff and fill from NYX. And this is a pomade pencil. Ooh, nice and dark. We like it. And I'm going to use the Milk uh, Kush Mascara. I got a little sample of it from Sephora. And I have got it in my cart for Sephora for because I'm loving it so much. It's making my eyelashes look long and feathery in the best possible way. You can tell how pretty they look. And I've been shopping around for some green lippies and it's hard to find a good green lippy that's going to do exactly what I want. But look how pretty this is. It's so pretty. And I've got a new lippy that I got from Gerard Cosmetics and it's a nude and it is called Mile High. And I'm going to try this today. So pretty. And I've just heard the best things about these lips, these lippies from Gerard. And this is the palest nude that I have. I won't go any paler. Like the real pale nudies look like I'm a corpse. So here we have it, a sweet little look with the jalapeno bite size palette. I just love it. I hope you're having a great day or day of your choice. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you real soon.